and now to the celebration of an octogenarian. Clocking its it signifies a lifetime of treasured experiences, notable achievements, and cherished memories, especially when serving God who has it been. This was where best described Princess Margaret Adeola Salako, who recently celebrated her 80th birthday in grand style. Muiwa Omoumi was at the ceremony and has more details on this. The celebration is to welcome Princess Margaret Adeola Salako to the 8th floor. The event held in Oton Aigbaju, Oshun State, was filled with families and friends who traveled from far and near to celebrate the new octogenarian. Reverend Father Michael Akinsodi of St. Nicholas Cathedral Church, Oton Aigbaju, in his sermon says, Christians should always be thankful for the gift of life at all times. He described Princess Salako as a devout Christian. Joyfully and radiantly, the celebrant came out with dancing offerings with other family members to thank God for clocking 80 years on night. <laughs> There was a special prayer for Princess Salako. The good music and shades of different colors from the hall welcomed the elegantly dressed Princess Margaret Adiola Salako into the reception. <laughs> She was described as a mother and grandmother who loves her children as much as she loves every other child around her. I want uh, women especially to learn to look after their children. This woman took time to look after her children and today there is reason for her to be celebrated. Mama has been very nice to me, like she's very nice to everybody. She's very hardworking. And I thank God for our life. For the celebrant, clocking it is a privilege and grace of God. I'm so happy because I never expected my children could celebrate my 8th birthday like this. Mama is a very good man. She's my mother-in-law. She's the best woman I've seen. She's kind, she's loving, she's prayerful. And she's the best. She loves everyone around her. Feel fulfilled. I don't think she has experienced anything like this before. As in personally being celebrated like this, I think this will be the first in her life. So we, we, we are thankful to God and we are grateful. A woman that will sacrifice everything to make sure people around her survive. Even the, the children of uh, the cousins, the nephews, all of them, she was dedicated to the survival of everybody when they're growing up in life. She's a very nice person, she's very cheerful, she's clocking 80 today, and she's very strong, she's agile. So, I'll just say my grandma is my role model because she's a very great woman, and then she trained with kids the way of the Lord. A very kind grandmother, she has been so nice to us, so caring. Most times, even when we go for breaks, do, um, holidays in our place, and then she's always taking care of us. Even the little things she has, she makes sure that we are satisfied and all of that. She's very loving. Highlight of the event was the dance by the celebrant and cutting of the birthday cake. <laughs> Earlier, an edifice in the heart of Oton Aigbaju was dedicated to Princess Margaret Adiola Salako as a gift by her children to mark her 88th birthday celebration from Oton Aigbaju in Noshon State. Muiwa Omaumi, NT News.